All right, I want to show you how to do the settings for your power options, which is also the settings for which time your monitor falls asleep and your PC. Click on the start menu, control panel, and in here, right here is your power options. Now yours might not look like that. I'm pretty sure that if you haven't changed it, yours looks like this. If that's the case, you click on security settings and then power options. You also have the small icons and you can have it in there it is right there. Now if you have trouble finding any one of them, you can just about figure out what you think it would be called. You can type it in there and it pretty much shows up there on the left. Like power options for instance. There's power options. Now since it's here I'll already click on it. Alright, mine used to be balanced, recommended. Well, that's really not so hard on your computer and you know it, it's it's just about the same thing but it's just not quite as high performance as this one I always have mine on this whichever one you decide you want you have to click on change plan settings and this here is your monitor I got mine set at 10 minutes and I always make sure that my PC stays on at least 10 to 15 minutes longer than my monitor your computer goes into idle mode after not being touched for 10 minutes sometimes 15 depending on the computer and then you'll notice that the light comes on on your computer well that's more or less your computer configuring everything that you've done within that sh that amount of time that you were on it and if there's any Microsoft updates available then that's when they will be installed that idle time is very very important you just you can tell by that when the light comes on that you can see it's 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 really working hard now you can set either one of them and both of these are the same as this you can set it all the way to never and I do that every once in a while like if I'm uploading a video to YouTube or if I'm running a full system scan on my antivirus you definitely don't want your PC to fall asleep so it's why I'm saying it's a good idea to know where to go change these but make sure your PC stays awake for 10 minutes after your monitor at least and then you click save changes now if you just decide that you want to go from high performance to the balanced one you don't have to change the save change because you never did any of the settings now for power saving that's really really only need to use that if you have a laptop see that's factory settings there that ought to tell you how they decided but notice 15 minutes they got the PC running in five minutes for the monitor they allowed the 10 minutes for it to idle time and configure now if you want to do your I won't get too into it too far but for your passwords I notice it's right here too so let me show you you can click on there and you can you can change your username password or whatever or you can create a user account right there like if you don't already have one well me I'm always afraid of losing my password forgetting it and if I wanted somebody else to get on the computer for me and find something then I'd have to tell them the password anyway so I just choose not to have it that's really pretty valuable when you have kids but other than that I just leave it alone alright then I guess that explains most of it thank you guys very much for watching